This is the Duck Hunt Clay Pigeon Combo Break Guide. Duck Hunt can cancel the amount of end like he has on his side B by absorbing the hit stun of a weak move. Sometimes, the amount of frames saved is so much you can combo Clay Pigeon into a fully charged F Smash. It's hard to land on Pikachu, however. But you can get the perfect hit. This is where we return to the bug glitch exhibition video from patch 5.0. Ideally, Duck Hunt would like to follow up any combo break Clay Pigeon into an F Smash, but we have to remember that F Smash has X axis and Y axis problems. Because of this, Duck Hunt being able to combo Clay Pigeon into F Smash is RNG based. Even if you have enough frames for a fully charged F Smash to combo. Let's count the frames on Bowser using his up B. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In one frame, Duck Hunt throws Clay Pigeon and combos it into an F Smash for a kill. There's lots of different moves you can do this on, and the follow up doesn't always have to be an F Smash. Keep in mind this is your other frame 1 defensive option if you don't have can around. Now let's look at the move from a different camera angle. As we can see here, Duck Hunt is in the middle of his throwing animation when it gets cancelled. And thus the Clay Pigeon will be thrown while Duck Hunt is still in hit stun. The animation for Duck Hunt's side B starts on frame 1, but it's normally supposed to come out on frame 17. Thus we can have the move start on frame 1 and be cancelled on frame 1. The ability to cancel the startup and heavily reduce the end lag of Clay Pigeon with this tech is what allows it to get a crazy amount of plus frames for combos.